Well, our platform is uh, is exceptionally up to speed. We are always making improvements to it, uh, be it adding new um, indicators or our signaling tools. We're currently working at putting signaling tools in place which allow you to get an alert if an actual trend line or support level is breached and you can trade uh, based on that alert or leave it alone. Um, so it has good, easy nav nav navigation. You also have access to the analyst insights from the platform as well. Uh, we have third party research taken from the likes of Trader Central, which gives you technical analysis on the majority of the instruments there. We also have pattern recognition, which can be very useful for the, the technical analysis trader as well. So you have a list of all the instruments down on the left hand side and you can choose to make your own watch lists so that you can concentrate on the ones that really interest you. And of course, if you decide to deviate from the, the normal popular watch list, uh, we have the likes of bonds, we have spread differentials, uh, we also have different commodities such as you know, um, oats and wheat. All of those are there for you to trade if you feel uh, that you have the propensity to do so. Now, you will generally find that the uh, majority of clients will always be long equities. Um, there is a sort of um, a code that exists that uh, the human wants to see markets go ever higher. So there is generally, in my view, from the, from the retail perspective, uh, a rather positive outlook on the markets that doesn't necessarily uh, parlay well into what is actually going on in the markets. Uh, but they can be a very useful tool uh, to see what everyone else is doing and you can decide to either take the popular view or the contrarian view. And um, of course, contrarians often get it wrong, as do trend followers. So generally speaking, it is very well looked at, particularly in regards to FX pairs and commodities. And uh, I think it's been uh, a useful tool for our traders over the last number of years since we introduced it. So you can see how many would have opened or closed trades in the last hour, four hours, last day, last week, and you will have a, a good viewpoint as to whether the 60, maybe what percentage of the IG client base is long on a particular instrument and obviously what percentage is short. Um, and of course, sometimes you will find that there's a 50% split and that can be very interesting when it comes to the likes of the FTSE. And it's generally when the market is moving ever so slightly sideways where there is a, a period of indecision in the market that's reflected very, very well in the IG client sentiment as well, where 50% uh, believe the market's going to go up and 50% believe the market's going to go down and I find that can be very very useful um, particularly in times of consolidation uh, because it can give you a range um, as to where you might put your trade either your, your, your order to go long once it escapes the current range it's in or in order to go short once it drops to the bottom of the support so when I see a 50% sentiment on the the indices themselves I think it as a, as a very good opportunity because you will generally in the, in the immediate aftermath see some pretty decent moves in either direction and it's just about being ready for those.